Hello everyone and welcome back to Bad Engineering Girl. Today, actually, before I get into what we're talking about, my name is Ria, for those of you who don't know me, and I'm on a journey engineering my life, both literally and figuratively. And that is because I am actually an engineering major, but I'm also engineering my life. Now today, I wanna talk about a philosophical idea or this idiom that everyone talks about and that is how time is always flying now this is for all my philosophical people out there who love ideas i'm right there with you this video is for you so without further ado let's get into why time is no longer flying for me so first let me give you a little bit of backstory i was probably the first person in line when it comes to oh my god where on earth is time going i know it was it was my habit and this is something my sister called me out on so 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 many times is as soon as i got to evening like around 7 to 8 p.m i would always say oh my god how is it already x p.m and my sister would always go like oh my god ruha why do you say that every single day like i would say this every single day oh my god how did the entire day pass omg how is it 6 p.m oh my god how is it 7 p.m where did the day go these were things that i said every single day and this is a habit that i actually don't do anymore i actually don't say these things anymore and recently when someone was saying oh my god i can't believe how Ramadan just passed, like I, I feel like it didn't even come, I subconsciously, without even thinking about it, automatically said, oh my god, no, it came, I felt that, I lived through that, that did not pass. And this person looked at me like, okay, I got you, <laughs> calm down. But that got me thinking about how I don't have this habit anymore of saying, where did my day go? Or, oh my god, where is my time? and so on and so forth. So I started questioning, why is time no longer flying for me? Because this is a problem many, many, many people have and it was a problem that I had for my entire life, literally, my entire life. And so why didn't it fly for me anymore? And I got very, very curious. Now I thought about it and thought about it and thought about it some more and I came to the conclusion that it's because I have been trying very, very, very hard to be living more mindfully. Because I make the conscious act of living consciously, time no longer flies for me because I'm actively making decisions of how to spend my time. And because I make those decisions, I commit my time that way. It doesn't fly for me anymore. And this actually blew my mind because before I felt like I had no control over my time because it was just going everywhere and I felt like I was getting nothing done and getting everything done at the exact same time. Now, I feel like I have so much more control over my time because I'm actively making decisions of how to spend that time and doing it in a conscious way, not like in the way that, oh, I have to do this and I have to do this and I have to do this. No, it's like, I want to do this and I want to do this then, and I want to do this today. I'm very, very, very conscious about what I'm committing my time to. And because I actively make those decisions, it's no longer flying for me because I live through that moment consciously. I live through the experience. And because I live through it consciously, it's not a blur in my brain anymore. Now, I hope this hasn't gotten too philosophical or intangible if that's the word for you all. I really hope you're still with me because this is an idea that I really, really, really like, honestly. I like all ideas because I'm an INTJ and INTJ and ideas are synonymous. But this is an idea that really, really resonates with me because I've consciously tried to be more mindful of what I'm doing, what am I consuming, how am I spending my time? Am I doing what I want to do? Am I actively making the decision to do X, Y, Z? And I can clearly see the effect of that in my life. 
I no longer feel like time is slipping through my fingers and my life is washing away without having any whatsoever control over that. Like someone is puppeteering my strings. I no longer feel that way. And it's such, such a fantastic feeling to no longer feel like my time is flying. It's such a fantastic feeling to live consciously, to make decisions consciously, to consciously decide what am I going to do? Who am I going to be? What am I going to say? What am I going to feel? It's such a liberating way to live. Such a liberating way to live. Now, I won't go rambling on about this topic. I wanted to put this idea out there in the world and help it resonate with people out there who need this idea and who are looking for an idea like this because I really do hope that it, it helps you because it's just doing this has changed my life, literally. Among many other things, this has changed my life. Now, I'm gonna end this video before it gets too long. So, thank you for staying with me up till here. Until next time.